The next tip is how to apply one effect on several cuts. So the first thing that we need to do is to mark in point and out point and let's go to quick transition and if we're going to choose apply to all transition in and out it will automatic update to the timeline but what if we want to choose a different effect that don't have the option to apply to the in and out so in order to do so let's go to our first frame and I'm going to choose a classic color correction let's play a little bit with the colors Okay, maybe like this, okay, and I'm going to switch to source record edit. Now we can see that the effect was applied only to the first video. And what if I want to apply it to this video and this and this? In order to do so, we just need to do a simple step. Let's create a new bin. We are going to call it effect bin. Okay. Let's jump back to the timeline. I'm going to open the color correction and I'm going to drag this icon here. So, if I will take the icon and apply it here, it will change the color as we did here. If I want to apply it to a few videos, I'm going to press segment mode and by holding shift button, I'm going to choose our videos that I want to color correct them. And now just simply double click it and it will update here. Let's do our final example, reformat, maybe this one. I like this letterbox. So, Let's do it again. I'm going to press segment and choose by clicking, by holding the shift. Let's press this one, two, three, four. And I'm going to the effect palette, double click. And you can see that everything was applied as we need it. The last thing that we're going to learn here is how to remove the effects with the same way. Let's press segment mode select all by clicking shift we can add more videos and just simply press delete button and it will remove all the effects